Alright, so we're going to begin by multiplying integers. So again, integers being positive and negative numbers, we'll just start playing with them together and see what happens when we times them. So I first want to point out, remember a little trick here. If the signs are opposite, you're going to get a negative number. So a positive times a negative, and a negative times a positive, will give you a negative number. And if the signs are the same, positive times positive, negative times negative, in this case, you'll get a positive number. So opposite signs are negative, same signs are positive. So looking at the examples we've got, negative 5 times 10. Well, let's remember something for a minute. Um, can I assume that the 10 here is a positive or a negative? Remember, if there's no sign written, so we will assume it's positive if there is no sign. So here I can assume that I've got negative 5 times a positive 10. So I'm noticing I'm saying negative times a positive, negative times a positive, so I know I'm going to get a negative answer. And now I'll think about what's 5 times 10 which is 50. In the next example, I'm thinking here, as I look at it, that I've got a negative times a negative. Negative times a negative, those are both the same sign, so I'm going to get a positive, and it's going to be 7 times 2, which is 14. Next example, 4 times 3. Well, there's no sign written, so I can assume that those are both positive numbers. That's positive 4 times positive 3, it's going to give me a positive, because they're the same sign. And we can say that's 12. 4 times 3 is 12. And our last example, 6 times negative 8. Here I'm noticing it's just a 6, so I can assume that it's a positive 6. And that's a negative number. So these are opposite signs, meaning I'm going to get a negative number. So 6 times 8 is negative, in this case, 42. 6 times negative 8 will be negative 42. So, in this case, we've got opposite signs for these examples and same signs for these examples. Where we notice same signs become positive, opposite signs become negative. And if you're thinking, oh, I don't need to write that positive number, you're right. You can just write 14 and you can just write 12. You do not need to write that positive, just like the problem often doesn't write the positive. So just remember that. Opposite signs will become negatives, same signs will become positives.